Hi, Pastor Brandon here, and I just wanted to take a moment of your day to talk about where God will be leading us in His Word this week on Sunday as we gather as a family of families to sing praises to God, pray with and for one another, and to hear and respond to a message from God's Word. This Sunday's message title is, It's Advent Again. Of course, it isn't Advent yet, but the season of Advent is upon us. The prelude to the season of Christmas is indeed here. Now before you plug your ears and scream, it isn't even Thanksgiving yet! Hear me out. Every year when approaching the season of Advent, I'll be at my favorite, favorite time of the Christian calendar. My preaching anxiety hits its peak. I often wonder in my mind, what is it I can say or do to communicate to people about the story they've heard their entire lives, about the coming of Jesus to us, the coming of Emmanuel, God with us? What can be said that hasn't already been said? What can be said that can help renew our hearts and minds and prepare us for the coming of Jesus that hasn't already been Said, It's all been said. And every year I fight this battle, approaching this most wondrous time of the year. And I realize something. It isn't about what is said behind a pulpit during this time of the year that truly matters. It is all about how we, God's people, choose to approach this holiest of time on our calendars. It is about how we enter into and live in this moment in community on mission with Jesus. And this is exactly what we are going to be talking about and addressing this Sunday, the Sunday before Advent. How we as God's people can approach this holiest of time on the church calendar as we eagerly wait with anticipation of the coming of our Lord Jesus and how we as God's people can live in this time, preparing our hearts and the hearts of those around us for what God is about to do. I fully believe it is in this we can truly renew our hearts and minds and prepare ourselves for Emmanuel, prepare ourselves for the coming of Jesus to us this Christmas. Join us then this Sunday as we crack open the Christmas story and parallel it with Paul's writings in Philippians 2, 1 through 11, and learn how it is God wants us to approach and to live in this time of preparation through how Jesus approaches and lives it himself. Learning the full meaning behind the season of Advent and what it is for. In this challenging us, to leave behind our self-preoccupation this season of Advent and Christmas for a radical selflessness, a radical other-focusedness approach like Jesus demonstrates to us and for us. Understanding through all this how we choose to approach and live this Advent will greatly impact ours and others' attitudes approach in life this Christmas. It's Advent again. Or is it Advent again? Join us this Sunday in community on mission with Jesus at 9.30 a.m. We'll see you there, and the coffee pots will be full and hot.